dog. Hello, how are you? I am a dog. Is Sorry. that the intro? Yeah, that's the intro. <laughs> Hi, Hi my name. <laughs> my name is Mari. I'm Stacy. And this is a quick look of the Mind's Eclipse. <laughs> Let's start. Let me liberate you, Jonathan Campbell. Is that somebody imp- important? I don't know who that is. Oh, we're gonna look like plebs. Oh, married people. What's a pleb? Plebeian. Plebe. Okay, so they're married. Now there's one hand, so that means they're not together anymore. The machine. I was trying. I will save save her. It will save her. It will save her. John, she's awake now. Oh, maybe that's the name of the character, because when I looked up. But there isn't much time. We gotta be really dramatic. But there isn't much time! I will save her. Hannah! Oh, God, what are you doing to her? Oh, no. She doesn't look happy about what you've done. She's like, can you not save me, please? What is... See, this is not... She hates Oh, so, her. by the way, just to... We got this code, and I thought it looks cool because it's all hand-drawn. Yeah, and that's... We like unique thi- Oh, the darkness got her. Mm-hmm. Hannah! Hannah! John. Who's there? You're awake! And here I thought you were a goner. I can't see! My eyes! Okay. Yeah, yeah, give me a sec. I'm trying to pretend that I'm a very dramatic scientist. Oh, yeah. You know, like, you know, one of those guys, like, Hannah, I can fix this! She's like, please just take me to the hospital, please, John. It was a I cold! Just... I had the flu! <laughs> Hi, is that better? Oh, God, no. And AI? No, that's not Hannah. This is the AI. Ah, the famed intelligence. I understand it now. Wait, why can't I see? Your implant needs tweaking. There, much better? Your hands find the scarred eye sockets. What happened to my eyes? How about now? Almost. Perfect. For my next trick, I will make a lame man walk. Let's try that again. I'm L, AI designator ECH 35536. Nice to meet you. How's it going? Can you believe this weather we're having? Blah, 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 blah. Come on, let's go. Go where? Where am I? Where is Hannah? (laughs) You must tell me what's going on. You don't have a lot of options here, guy. This hospital is running out of oxygen. You can stay here, but you'll be dead in about five minutes. In this, about 45 minutes. This is must be a space hospital if it's running out of air. I know that... So I know that this has something to do with, like, I dystopia, maybe? It's a space... Or maybe it's a place where they charge you for oxygen. That's... No, that's entirely possible. I don't know too much about it. Well, 42.36 minutes to be exact. But I think you get the picture. All right. I'm getting up. Whoa. Every environment is interactive. Hover over objects to explore. Press this button or press space bar to exit. Use these buttons to access the menu, inventory, and move via the map and hotkeys. Thanks for pointing it out with your toes. You're welcome. Stacy was pointing to each part with her toes. It was very informative. This is how you should do presentations. <laughs> just laying down and being like... Just laying, t- reclining on a chair and just pointing the... And you'll see over here, our profits have been going up for the past five years. Unfortunately, <laughs> see? company morale is still struggling. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, company morale is struggling. You can see the line pointed out here. It about follows the shape of my toes. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Search the man. Ooh, he's got Cybertronic. Oh, God! Is this like... Oh, no, that's Why do we only have three fingers? No, we have five. Okay, and that one... Biomedical operate... What? Did we, like, interface with him? Are are, Are we brain hacking? Brain, okay. No, hon, click the... 
those. Ah, yes. It's so strong. Must fight. Must fight the song. It's so beautiful. This is a message from the Board of Public Safety. Removal of biomedical operating system, Bose implants, is both unsafe and illegal. If you know someone involved with Bose removal, report them immediately. Their immune systems may be compromised and quarantine may be necessary for the safety of the core. Remember, only through community will we achieve the eclipse. Board of Public Safety, Office of the Tower. Oh, you know what? The way it reads, it kind of makes me feel that they're not worried about the person, but more no. about the equipment. Yeah. It's like, For it's sure. illegal because the equipment can be hurt. <laughs> and you're like, wait, hold so on. So biomedical operating system, I guess that suggests that, like, everybody has an implant that, like, allows them to, like, interface with different systems and stuff. So we are brain hacking. If you ever wake up, don't trust them. They know about the non-parody event. Remember your family. Remember why we did this. I hear it now. The song. And I embrace it. What was that? You just use your Bosey interface to connect with someone else's. Oh my god. So it's like in Soma. Remember where they can like go they into They all have this... the brains. Yeah. yeah. And they were being like... And in that other game... Well, like, how they can read... They can oh, the, connect and, with each other's implants. And with um, the Turing test where they were subconsciously being co controlled by mm. the AI. Was I inside his head? More like inside his email client. Okay. By the way, there that's some fancy hardware you're carrying. Most people around here still use the old plugs. My skin... It merged with him. That would be your nanites. Ah, idiot. Of course. Fucking moron. Those are your nanites. What are you from, Grandpa? It's not your skin, duh. I help maintain your bosey and thus monitor your nanite levels at all times. Of course. So she's in our head. Oh, we're like, it's a scan in our eyeball? I, yeah, thing. so I, I don't think that she's like an actual physical presence because she's just said that... Remember, we could see her when his eyes weren't eyes weren't open. Yeah. Quote, quote. She is like a brain projection. Yeah. What happened to this man? Why is his dead body here? He suffered from multiple gunshot wounds, and thus some internal bleeding. I don't remember any of this. Was I involved somehow? <laughs> Your voice. You didn't shoot him, if that's what you're asking. I'm just trying to play like you know that one guy who's like, nah, I can I can take care of it, Susan. And Susan's like, please stop. What was this from? I'm just making up oh, like a just, character just, in my yeah, head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like overly masculine guy who like tries to do it himself, but he's just making I'm it worse. I'm so gruff and I've got everything under control. You gotta trust me, Hannah. Why? You just do. Mm -hmm. Do you really not remember any of this? No. Well, we can figure that out later. Right now, you have bigger problems. Like, breathing. I didn't find anything useful in his bosey. <laughs> Try searching his pockets. The man's pocket yields. Secure card. For decades, wireless systems offered too many security hazards to be considered for sensitive environments. This crystalline secure card offers basic security access via optical cryptography. Secure cards are common on the core, though many companies have since opted for neural locking methods for extremely important matters. So, this looks vaguely religious, kind of like... I was just thinking that. I know it doesn't it really, of, but it does. How it looks kind of like a cross, like an upside down cross a little bit. Yeah, I was just wondering. But I also wasn't sure whether that's like the, like the first aid symbol. Yeah, but I feel like, you know, in a game like this, it, it's possible they may be going for something like that. Well, you know? they did particularly say, like, if we are if we are going to reach the eclipse, that would suggest some sort of, like... So I'm not saying it's, like, Christianity per se, but maybe no. they want you to have the idea of religious overtones yeah. in it. Did you read the whole thing? Yep. Okay. Okay. This might be helpful. So mouse over, okay. Oh, things that get blurry you can interact with. Yep, looks like a data terminal. The screen is busted. An old robot sits in the corner. Hello? Hello? 
I was talking to to the de to the deactivated Isaac. I just wanted to remind you that the air is leaving this room. Uh, is Isaac a biblical term? A biblical name? Isaac is a biblical. You're asking the wrong person. I don't know. No, no, no. I like. It sounds like a biblical name. I think Isaac is a biblical name, but I was also going to say that um, you turn the robot over, but find nothing useful. What were you going to say? It looks kind of like, she reminds me of like how you would, like a, like a succubus, because it looks like she has horns on the top of her head. Oh. Or some sort of demon. Yeah. So succubi are demons, but they feed off of sexual energy. Yeah. But I was just, like, the fact that she has the, looks like the only way out of here. Dude, we're, we're dealing with cyber demons, dude. Mm-hmm. Like, see, what's the thing on the back of her head, you know? We need to keep moving. Yeah, you're right. It does kind of look like a demon, but, like, yeah, you're totally right. But, like, futuristic demon. I just, like, if we're going, if we're thinking that there are supposed to be religious overtones, like here we have the symbol of a sun. And, and yet again like, we have Stacy demonstrating with, with her toes. So here we have the symbol of a sun, and then like before they were talking about eclipse and like a non-parody event, like these just seem yeah. Very there biblical. Should be, there should be an elevator down the hall to the right. It'll bring us to the next level and to the exit. Where is this place? It looks abandoned. It's the core regional hospital. It's it's lack of air probably explains why it's abandoned. I don't remember any of this. I'm not even sure what my name is. I can help with that. Information that I heroically salvaged off this hospital's network informs me that you are Jonathan Campbell. Why are you so interested in helping me? Jonathan well, Campbell. Well, I think she's in his head, so it's in her interest to keep him alive. Yeah, but how did she get in his head? That's my question. She's in the implant. Yeah, but if he didn't... So, if he's always had the implant, why would she have to salvage his name from the hospital records? Oh, I didn't... So, it's in, I feel like it's an implication that she's something new to his experience. I think but... she is. I think that he was brought here and somebody put the implant in him. And that he's waking up now. That's what I. That's what I thought. I thought this was some sort of like twenty-eight days later situation where it's like somebody like wakes up in a hospital and like everyone's gone. I feel like I he know. was probably like trying to help Hannah and accidentally created some sort of black goo demon. Maybe. Why did they leave me here? Maybe because you put inquisitiveness ahead of breathing. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. I get it. Let's go. A series of beds and medical equipment can be seen through the window. This hallway continues on into darkness. Trash litters the expansive hallway. There are no signs to indicate where the hall leads. So if we press so if we press move, oh, it starts to trash. What are you doing? I'm searching for clues. We need to keep moving. What is it that you don't want me to see? That's not how I took that. I took that as more like the air's running out in 40 minutes. So that could be a lie. Discarded equipment litters the floor in places. Repurposed nanites. Welcome to the nano age. Everything you see and interact with on the core has been touched in some way by the intersection of nanotechnology and engineering. This bag of nanites could, could be used to bolster one's immune system or to aid in biological repair. Disclaimer, the recipient of this pack should ensure their Bose implant has been updated to the latest firmware for proper integration. Firmware? Hmm. So, yeah. Oh. Buy it. Ooh. What does it say? Pravia V, the old man is here. The old man is here. We need him alive to fix this. Remember the plan. Leave him to me. Oh, look, it's, it's from a, a robot with a mustache on it. <laughs> I'm, so fun. Do you think that that's, like, who actually said this? Or do you think that that's, like, their, like, avatar. hacker, their avatar? 
No, I want to believe that this is a robot. So, that the uh, uprising is led by robots with mustaches. No, it's just they're a part of society now, and that's just this is a hipster robot. Oh, I was thinking like robot uprising. Nope, it's a, it already happened a hundred years ago, and robots are now just a part of mm. society. Well, that doesn't mean they can't rise up. Rise up even more. You can more. rise up at any time, Mari. There's always time for a revolution. You gotta rise up again. Yeah. The second time. More more rising. Yeah. They keep making fun of my mustache. It's time to rise up. Mm-hmm. Uh, Press move. Oh. Up. Okay. And then we, you can choose which way to go. Yeah. Your wife is not happy about what you did. John, are you okay? Hannah, my wife, she died. I remember now. What else do you remember? Uh, I'm not sure. I remember growing up, my parents, but I don't remember how I got here. But Hannah, I remember that she's gone. Look, I know this must be difficult, but we need to keep going. Time is running out. I don't believe you. Don't go near that. What is it? Rogue nanites. Potentially dangerous. So many? I can see them buzzing about. It's your buzzy implant. It registers the nanites in your virtual vision. How did we lose our eyes? Oh, yes. She she probably did it. She ripped our eyeballs out. But she's not a physical being, I don't Dude, think. Dude, how can mirrors be real if her eyes aren't real? <laughs> okay, <laughs> Jane Smith. <laughs> don't worry, John. We'll figure everything out once we get to safety. But the question is, if these are new bo- eyeballs put in by the demon lady... No, we, can don't, we, ha- we don't have eyeballs. We have new eyeballs. We got robot but eyeballs. They sh- but they showed, like, our face and our... Like, our eyeballs are all, like, gone. Okay, we have machine-like vision abilities. Does that make you feel better? I meant new vision from robots. Oh, okay. Robot eyes. Okay. But how can we trust what we're seeing if she's the one in control of what we're seeing? I don't know. Exactly. I don't trust this lady. I'm gonna... I'm gonna touch it. All right, no, you're just gonna... And, okay. Oh, okay. So if you press... Oh, oh. Yeah. Another Isaac lies in the hallway. It appears to be in low power mode, but may be accessible. Interface with the robot. Patient log 769. Patient's emaciation is advanced. I knew that the kids were getting hooked, but this is disturbing. Are they hooked on on future nanites? Future drugs. Aren't there limiters in place? Where were this boy's parents while he was wasting away in a VR pod? <laughs> Patient shows textbook signs of VR addiction. <laughs> We're not even sure that he knows he's been unplugged. This hospital, the nurses, wires in his arm. He could very well think it's all part of some game. Xavier Ruiz, uh, Ruiz, senior practitioner of Core Hospital. Oh, maybe that's what happened to us. It's possible. He's addicted to VR. <laughs> I don't really think that sounds that far-fetched. It's just a weird... Eye drugs. In the future, did you notice that all drugs are taken through your eyeball? I mean, people, like, <laughs> people already get addicted to video games. I know, but it's a funny word. Stacey's so like, no, it's a serious addiction. VR. Some people go. Yeah, the hallway continues this way, but the end is out of sight. I've lost lots of friends. So, move. pick move. And it, no... Oh. This room is a mess. Medical equipment lies toppled on the, onto the floor. This stuff, stuff has been, been here for years. Oh, look, look at this. Don't trust the... Is that an X? Well, it's probably behind the robot. Let's look at it. Something is scrawled on the wall. Don't trust the AI. Oh. Don't trust this demon robo cyber demon Telling lady. You, they made her look like a demon for a reason. Yeah, you're right. Good catch. I... L. Can you see everything that I see? More or less. You still there? My sensors don't indicate you asphyxiating yet. What was your primary function before you found me? I was a doctor. My specialties included pediatrics and internal medicine. And you've been trying to get everyone out of the hospital? No. I was reactivated more recently. What happened to the others? Did they make it? Mm. 
I don't know. They were already dead when I awoke. I tried to leave. Until you found me. Exactly. And I realized that the oxygen was running out. I couldn't leave you. Plus, the network is firewalled, so I can't just catch a data stream out of here. So she wants us to live and leave. So we've been playing for 20 minutes, so that's a good quick look. Right? I think so. Well, uh, let us guys know what you think. I think the story is pretty... Like, I want to keep going, but then I, like, you know, we're doing a quick look. Yeah, I know. I, <laughs> I am I am interested, though, to see where this goes. Yeah. And I think the art style is really cool and different. It's very unique. Do you mm -hmm. know where to get this game or buy it or... On Steam? You can get it on Steam. Do you know how much it is? I mean, you redeemed a Steam code. To yeah, do... I know, Stacy. I'm asking for the audience. <laughs> I'm asking for the Don't audience. Mari! <laughs> God, you downloaded Office of and I'm like, Stacy, where can you find and buy this game? Oh, <laughs> uh, Mario, you fucking it's, know where to get it, you idiot. It's called The Mind's Eclipse. It is available on Steam. Do you know how much it is? I don't know. Uh, here it is on screen. Bloop, that's how you know. Bye. Bye. She <laughs> just got excited. Like, someone's yelling. We gotta yeah. go. <laughs>